Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, family. Uh, let's talk about it. Uh, I don't want to see. I'm a little heated right now. None of you talking about Black Lives Matter. Black lives do not matter. They don't matter because they don't even matter to black people. Oh, you can get mad about this video all you freaking fracking want to because I could care less. Okay? Anytime I'm sitting out with my grandbabies, this is the second time I'm so sick of you ignorant uh, shell of human beings that's running rampant in these communities wreaking havoc on the elderly, on children, and on people that you deem is and, you, and you're a coward because you don't you don't and you can't come like this. You're shooting people and you're riding through. You're shooting at people and you're such a damn bad shot that most of your targets you miss and you hit kids in trampolines and you kill them. You hit two year olds sitting in their bed. Or you do like you did the girl right down the street from me. Shoot her when she in her damn kitchen making some toast. Let me tell you black ignorant fool something right now. You talking about white people and what white people do to us? I don't want to hear it. I do not want to hear it. Until black lives start mattering to black people. Don't say shit to me. Oops, I hope this... Mm. Don't say nothing to me about black lives matter. They don't matter. Black lives don't matter to black people. There's a certain segment of black people that black lives don't matter. And guess what? That segment is so out of control, they can't come back. They are a waste. They are a bad hand. They are crap. They are all red cards. When you play in spades. I'm sitting on my porch with my grandchild. And these fools are letting off rounds. I don't know who got hit, but somebody did. Because the ambulance and everything was over there afterwards. But one thing I feel good about, they caught y'all asses. They caught you, didn't you? About three blocks from where you started your mayhem on innocent people. You got people who own homes can't even go sit out on their damn porch because of y'all asses. My grandson had already told me when the girl got shot in her head, her head was doing like this. Boom, 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 boom. Because he was on it that close on the kid playing on the playground. And he could actually see the blood being pumped and pulsated out of his, out of the girl's skull. What damage is that doing to my grandson? What damage has it done? Because he's already traumatized. He's already seen it. White people didn't give him that vision. White people didn't put that trauma on his mind at five years old. We did. We did. Don't y'all understand that this is a problem? We need all hands on deck. And we have been driven mad. So what are we going to do about it? We can't depend on white folk. Can't depend on them at all. How are we going to police these communities? Where are the men? Who are going to come? Let me calm down. Who are going to police these communities against these savages? Huh? 
I don't want to hear nobody say nothing. I don't want to talk about white people. I want to talk about us. Charity begins at home and then it spreads abroad. So unless you black people want to talk about black problems and black issues and black murder, I don't want to hear nothing else about white people. As long as y'all running through this community shooting us, shooting babies on the porches, on trampolines, in the bed, sitting on their porch, then black lives don't matter. Because how can you be a father out here humping up and down on women, producing children? They can't mean nothing to you either. That's just some that's just some waste out of your body. Because you cannot care about your children and then go shoot somebody else's. That's not how any of this works. It don't work like this. What the hell is wrong with us? What the hell is wrong with us? White people can't fix it. I'm tired of talking. I'm tired. I'm tired. Y'all so hard-headed, stiff-necked, rebellious, and you tell lies that, as Elijah Muhammad said, would bust the stomach of a brass monkey. We don't got to worry about what white people are doing it to us because we doing it to ourselves. We are doing it to ourselves. And as an elder in this community, I'll be damned. I'll be damned if I let somebody look like me destroy me. When are we going to start talking about eating our young? When are we going to start talking about policing ourselves? When are we going to look and find the drop squad out here? Because this right here, this right here, it can't go on. It can't go on. Killing babies. Missing your targets. You can't shoot worth shit. I'm done with you. I'm done.